I am coming at you because guess what launches tomorrow? Boom, ba -ba -boom. We've got all of the tint skins. The tint, I'm not gonna be able to not call it tint skin. You know what I'm you know what I'm talking about. Twin, twin skin. So I have all 18 shades here and I was trying to put them in order and then I'm like, why? Because I'm just gonna mess them up when I go live. But I wanted to show you, if you don't have yours yet, if you have yours, let me know. But you guys, the packaging is so beautiful. I love that the packaging, the shades vary, right? Um, but our new packaging and the marketing and just the time and effort they're putting into making sure that the presentation is spot on, is spot on. So we've got the name, we've got the description, a feather weight, breathable foundation infused with skin care level hyaluronic acid to help reveal a smooth, hydrated, even complexion with color true hydrophobic pigments, you'll achieve long wearing, buildable coverage with a seamless second skin finish. Now, one of the things that I wanna point out is this is skin care level hyaluronic acid. This is not a drizz up of hyaluronic acid so that they can advertise the heck out of it, but it's really doing nothing. That is what majority of things that are advertised with are doing. So maybe like, let me use oil of Olay retinol, for instance, is not doing diddly squat for the skin, except for giving you the bad, the bad potential um, risks because it's using bottom of the barrel, cheapest that they possibly can, and the teeniest, tiniest percentage that they can. So like, although retinol can give us good results, retinols are, are never less, but I'm using this as an example because there's commercials of it up the wazoo, right? Um, there can be good things that can come out of certain things on our Neverless, like retinol, but there also are bad side effects. When you're using a really crummy, really small percentage of it, you're not getting the good results, but it allows the companies to market it with retinol, right? But you are still getting the risks that are associated with it. Hyaluronic acid is not something that's bad for us, it's only good, but if you don't use enough of it in a product, you can advertise having it, but it's not really giving any of the benefits to the skin. Okay, another one that you'll see advertise a lot is with shea butter. So like there'll be like Jergens, blah, 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 skin smoothing, brightening, blah, 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 with shea butter. And then you look at the ingredients and shea butter is like one of the last things. That means they're like, oh, boop, just enough so that we can advertise it to have shea butter, but it's not doing anything for the skin. So the fact that this is skincare level hyaluronic acid, this is, I think it's nine times more than, than what our old tint skin used to be. And our old tint skin used to have a good amount in it. So this is significant amount of hydration and skin smoothing properties. 91% of users that tested it said that they visibly saw um, reduced wrinkles. So what hyaluronic acid does is it helps to bring all the moisture into the skin and plump up the skin, right? So if we're thinking skin plumping, one of the reasons I love this so much is because any of these little fine lines here, it helps to plump up. It helps to plump up this. It helps to plump up little teeny tiny wrinkles around my eyes. Or do you guys ever, maybe not you, but maybe clients, what people will talk about like if their under eyes look a little bit crepey, like it's not straight up wrinkles or crow's feet, but it's just like a crepey look when they put makeup on. That's because many makeups have drying properties to them. This does not. So it's not going to leave a crepey, weird, cakey look. It's not going to, it's going to be the anti-cakey. So I'm going to do, I think I wear 340. I'm probably 340 or a 310. So I've got a lot of questions about, ah, how do I sell this to people that aren't local that they can't test it? Well, we've got pictures. Okay. So color match. I sell this more. I sell more of this to, to non-local people. Most of my clients are not local to me, believe it or not. So you have a color match picture. So if someone's curious in a skin, in a skin, in a tint, in a skin twin, goodness, I am going to have trouble with this name for a while, in a twin skin, skin twin, then you're going to start with one of the pictures, okay? And you're going to look at their pictures. So be like, do you have some pictures I can take a look at? Or maybe I can look at your Instagram or Facebook. I'm not trying to be a stalker. I just want to help you with color matching. So you take a look, send them an image of the colors. And I would say send the official one that Beauty Counter has, but also that one with the famous people that we have in our, all of these pictures can be found in Team Beauty and Grace. Send both and say, that here's some examples. I think you would be either a shade 340 or a 310. What do you think? 
and let, let them take a look, right? So I'm also gonna demonstrate this. So I'm gonna put 340 on. And you guys, if you have not tried it with the retractable travel brush, you have not experienced amazingness yet. Like this is amazing product, even if we put it on with our fingers, but the brush, holy moly. This is one of the reasons I signed up as a consultant, you guys. If Michelle did not get me to get this brush, I don't know that I would have fallen as in love with this. So especially for people that are used to wearing powders, they're gonna, they're gonna like the application a lot better. So you start in the middle and then you work your way out. All right, and I go literally over my eyes, over my mouth, everywhere, because again, it's pumping. So like, why not get it everywhere, all right? So you're gonna go out. And this is gonna be buildable. So if someone wants a lot of coverage, they can then go in and spot treat certain areas with their fingers, or we also have a concealer brush. Um, I don't have it here right now, but it looks like it's like what we apply the mask with so it looks like a little like round it's really flat tight together bristles and that will allow you to put it on a little bit more concentrated if you know like no man i'm trying to cover some major scars or discoloration or whatever so here's my application this is a really light application and i have some redness here i have dark circles under my eyes here that just overall softened it all right, so this is the 340 on me. I probably could get away with the 310 as well. But if I was a, if I was trying to color match for a person, I'd give them, I'd say, this is about the color range I think you're in. And you guys, just use your eyes. This isn't science. We do have 18 colors, so I know people can be like mind boggled by that. But you have eyes. You know what colors are, right? Like you're going to be able to get really dang close. And you guys, be generous. I will say... Listen, if, like, what do you think? I think you're a 310 or a 340, but this picture, this picture, and this picture, is that your summertime or is that your wintertime? Because most of us are gonna be a teeny tiny bit darker in the summer. Most of us are gonna be a little bit lighter in the winter. So to say, which do you wanna play up? You know, I think that, I think either one would work, but what do you think? They know, they've got a brain. They're, they're gonna be like, oh yeah, that was on vacation. I was super tan then, but yeah, it is May. So let's go with the darker one, right? But I would also say, listen, we've got a 60-day money-back guarantee. If the color is not right, you can always return it and get your money back. But come to me first because I want to I want to make sure that you have the right color. I'll make it right. And you guys, I have always, always, in the almost four years of been doing this, just been like, if, if it's wrong, send it to me. I will send you the right color. They send it to me. I then have an extra one to make samples with or I use it myself or I use it in my in my kit or I'll use it as a gift. I never, never, never have had tint skin sit around and not go unused, right? So so please don't come from a space of, oh my God, I don't wanna come out of pocket $40 like to make it right because then at least you're not losing that sale, right? You're not losing that volume because if somebody buys it with a flawless and five, I do want you to know you can't just return one item. So if someone ever buys it with a flawless and five, I'm like, I'm gonna make it right because I don't want them to make them have to return all flawless and five set and then hope that they'll order again. You know what I mean? Like they can't just swap it out with beauty counter. So for swaps, I always take care of my people. And if you want more details, let me know. Um, I was also gonna show you 310, just so you know. So a few pieces of information. That hyaluronic acid is amazing. And like already my forehead wrinkles look so much softer. Maybe not to you because they are intense, but to me, they look a lot softer. So if I go the lighter shade, I really like that it's in this tube too because I know over the years people have like wasted a lot. I'm going to do a little bit lighter. Yeah, I think the 340 is better, but this isn't like, because it's just such a soft, not heavy pigment, if I wanted to wear that one, I could, I totally could, right? It's not like, ooh, this is the wrong color. Um, and if you wanted to go, give yourself a little bit more coverage, I'd like put a little bit more here, put a little bit more here. Um, anyways, it layers really nicely with all of the products. It's going to give you amazing coverage. I'm getting breathability. So this is going to be $45. It launches tomorrow, okay, which is Tuesday. We have the clean drop happening tomorrow. So tomorrow that's going to be a video with all the training on it. But if you want to get a little bit more up to date on the 8th, on May 8th, so that was what, last week, they did a preview video. So if you go to behind the counter and go back a page, you'll see they had like a pre-training, a preview training. So that'll give us a lot of information too if you wanna get up to speed on it. But the clean drop will have Michael. We all love Michael. Um, so that'll have some great information for you. 
and it's $45 for one of these. All of the assets are updated already. You'll see the photos. Michelle already put them in Team Beauty and Grace, but they're also behind the counter with the updated Flawless in 5. We'll have this starting tomorrow as well, okay? So there's not going to be a, tra a, a waiting period for that. If you have any questions, let us know. I would love to know if you guys want to maybe like share photos of you wearing it and tell us what color you are. I think that could be helpful for people too. Um, but if you have questions, let us know in here. Be ready for it. This is a really, really, really exciting push. Um, if you guys want any like kits, something that I'll do with people is I'll give people a free one of these brushes for any Flawless and Five purchases because I think that this is like such a nice thing to have because then you have it in your makeup bag. Guys, the fact that it can sit in your makeup bag and not get dirty is amazing. And these brushes, even if they don't want to use them for the foundation, they could use it for powder. They could put their mattifying powder on with it. If they want to use mattifying powder, they could put their blush on with it. So I have two of them. I have one that's my powder and one that's my wet one. Um, but that's a good incentive that you can do yourself is that you'll treat them to a brush with flaws and five purchase because you're going to make your money back, um, you know, with, with that. Anyways, just some good ideas and um, yeah, be ready. Be ready to share tomorrow. I think doing little teasers today is fine. It's totally okay to be sharing about it. I like to share it like pretending like I'm trying, like, like I'll show that it says feather weight. It's like clearly a foundation, but they can't read the whole thing and just be like, guess what? Something big's coming tomorrow. Um, so share, share, share. The packaging, what I started talking about earlier, is amazing. It's got all the information on it. We've got our leaping bunny we've got our b corp on there we've got the clean you clean up nice thank you for recycling me on one side we've got the future is clean we're a leading a movement for future to a future where all beauty is clean beauty we formulate we advocate and we educate that's our motto for creating products i mean just getting this pr this product into somebody's hand could potentially switch them over to beauty counter for life like it has so much education just on the box the text to action is right inside. It is, they nailed it, you guys. And the softness. So one of the perks of the whole lip thing is if you guys um, wear lipstick and it ever bleeds, this helps to cut down on that as well because it's helping to plump up those fine lines so the lipstick doesn't have the areas to travel as much. So, so many selling points on this bad boy. All right, have fun at tomorrow's launch.